Hey, what's up guys? I want to make this special video for those of you who are battling flea infestations. So I have five fleas trapped inside this Ziploc bag. I'll just show you their status right now. Make sure that's focusing. It's kind of hard to see. Here we go, there you go. See, they're all live. They're moving around inside the bag. Uh, yep. See, that's one, two, three, four, and five. All right. So what I intend to do is use a timer and put it in the freezer to see how long it takes to freeze them to death, if at all. All right, here we go. I'm using my Frigidaire refrigerator, put it in the freezer. Um, typically it's zero degrees. Unfortunately, I don't have a thermometer in there, but typically the freezer can confirm my temperature settings for the freezer is factory setting. So about the default. And here is the model of my refrigerator. It's a Frigidaire FR. SXL R5 ES2. Let's go ahead and check out their and factory settings. The Frigidaire webpage, the temperature setting of the freezer is set to a negative 5 to 5 degrees. So we just say it's 0 degrees Fahrenheit in the freezer. The, in the top section right here, and then we're going to start the timer and see how long it takes to kill them all, right? There we go. A little science yeah, experiment. It just reached a 5 minute mark. Let me put the pause on that. Let's see what happened to the fleas. Let's see what happened to the flea circus. You guys froze it? Oh my goodness, I didn't expect it to be that fast, but they look like they're not moving right there. This is confirmed, we're checking it out. Right. Put it on the white surface so it's easy to see. Um, there you go. Seriously, are they, are they dead? Or are they in like a sleeping state? You know what, I'm gonna confirm it. I'll be back after a minute, let them warm up. Actually five minutes. I just wanna make sure they die off because of the cold. How you doing this guys? And I am right. These fleas are hardy. Don't think they're stupid. Once again, here is proof. They appear to be dead. They're probably at, in a dazed, frozen state, about to die. But when you let them warm up, just when you thought they were dead, they are kicking again. You know what? Now I am going to freeze them for a 10 minutes. And then we'll go from there, increments, to make sure they're dead. Kind of disappointed. Right, once again, put them in the freezer, start off the timer, and reset it, and go with 10 minutes, and however long it takes for them to die. Alright, here we go, 10 minutes. I'm pretty sure they're gonna be the same. Whoops, there goes my phone. I'm pretty sure they look, they're gonna appear dead. They look pretty much frozen. We'll let them be thaw. Let them thaw, I meant, for one minute and see if they actually die off, alright? Cross your fingers. Because if this doesn't work, I'm gonna freeze them in 30 minutes. Guys, I don't care the way while I'm cooking my dinner of steak and kale. Doesn't that look delicious compared to these dang fleas? So I went over 15 minute mark. Let's go ahead and put a stop to it. Let's go ahead and check on my flea circus. They appear pretty much dead. Let me shake them up. See if I can revive them. Last time it was five minutes. Um, they moved around. But it looks like they're pretty much dead. Yes. Yes, another win, another way of killing fleas. So last time I uploaded a salt and diatomaceous earth, they works, they worked, but unfortunately those take many hours, like upwards of six to 12 hours. But cold in itself, as you can see, at zero degrees Fahrenheit, it will kill them off, but it takes about 10 minutes to kill them off. But keep in mind when they're attached to a warm blooded host such as a dog or a coyote or the type such as a mammal, they can survive extreme temperatures. Another win against the fight against fleas. Yes. Hey guys, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe for more exciting videos such as this. 
food and product reviews. Take care of yourselves and your pets.